He first saw it as breaking news on WTVA 9 News at 10. The deputies and inmates hurt in a Friday night fire at the Lowndes County Jail are all okay. Three deputies and two inmates were taken to the hospital. One of the inmates was burned in that fire. The other suffered some smoke inhalation. WTVA's Chris Knowles spoke with the sheriff about the fire investigation. He's joining us live in Columbus with that update. Sheriff Eddie Hawkins says that the inmates were treated and released on that night. He says that the deputies were also treated and they have recovered. Now that fire happened on Friday night. Sheriff Hawkins says a prisoner started the fire in one of the six jail zones. They were in, they were nine, there were nine inmates in that zone. The sheriff is not releasing the name of the prisoner that started the fire. The fire caused extensive damage, however. Well, it's, it's been a long weekend, I'll tell you that much. Uh, we've had a lot going on with the, with the fire at the jail and, uh, of course, the, the fire here today. Uh, so, you know, when something like that happens at the jail, it's, it's an ongoing investigation with the incident that happened at the jail. And uh, hopefully we'll have some answers soon as to the cause and uh, any charges that may stem from that. There are 120 inmates housed in the Lowndes County Jail. All inmates are accounted for. The Sheriff Office has turned this investigation over to the Mississippi Department of Investigation. Reporting live in Lowndes County, Chris Knowles, WTVA 9 News.